Escort Monitoring Systems presents Installing and Configuring Fuel Level Sensors Escort To install the sensor, you need the installation kit and certain tools which will be covered in this video. Preparations Drain the tank with a pump. On the top of the tank, draw two diagonal lines. The ideal spot to mount the sensor is where they cross. This spot, as well as these ones, within the central chamber of the tank will do as well. On the selected spot, drill a hole of 3 mm in diameter for a hole saw. Next, using the 35 mm hole saw, drill another hole. Be sure to tilt the saw a bit to prevent the cut piece from falling down. Carefully remove it with a screwdriver or other tool. Measure the height of the tank with the ruler. Apply the measurement to the sensor's tube subtracting extra 15 mm. Cut the tubes with a metallic saw. Treat the cut edges with a sandpaper to remove any burrs. Insert the centrator into the tubes. Sensor calibration. To configure the wireless sensor, use a smartphone with a Bluetooth. When configuring it via PC, use a special USB adapter. To configure a wired sensor, you need a RS485 USB converter. When calibrating a sensor without fuel via the app, open the settings menu and hit the calibrate button. If calibrating a wired sensor via the PC configurator, click the sensor calibration button and then calibrate. Calibration with fuel. Cover the drainage holes of the tubes with a piece of insulation tape. Turn the sensor upside down and put it on the steady surface. Fill the tubes with fuel using a jerry can with a narrow outlet, for example. Open the app. In the settings menu, deactivate the calibration without fuel by tapping on the tumbler and tap the full button. When configuring the sensor from PC, in the sensor calibration menu, deactivate the calibration without fuel tumbler and click full. Let the fuel out of the tubes. Remove the insulation tape from the drainage holes. Then, if in the mobile app, Tap the empty button. In the configurator for a PC, in the sensor calibration window, click the empty button. Mounting the sensor. Be sure to put the gasket under the sensor's head. If needed, treat the gasket's edges with an oil-resistant sealant. Then mount the sensor on the tank guiding it through the hole you drilled. Fix the sensor with the screws from the kit. We recommend marking the spots for the screws in advance and then drilling the holes using a 2-3 mm drill bit. Tank Calibration In the mobile app, open the Tank Calibration menu and tap on the Start button. Select the folder to save the Tank Calibration table in. Select Draining or Filling Method. Enter the name of the file and establish the step or the quantity of fuel to be poured several times into the tank. Tap on the Continue button. Pour a portion of fuel into the tank via the filling neck. While adding more portions, 20 liters each for example, hit the plus button after each portion is added and the level is stable. Continue until the tank is full. Once the tank is filled, hit the three dots in the upper right corner and select Save to File. Cable Management The cable from the kit should be installed along with the rest of the wires of the vehicle, preferably on the inside of the frame and as far from any movable parts that could potentially cause damage to it as possible. Yet avoid putting tension on the cable or bending it excessively. Connecting sensor to tracker. Depending on the operating mode selected for the wired sensor, connect the corresponding output in accordance with the contacts and wires section of the manual or the sensor's datasheet. Tank calibration on PC. Click the calibration and then run buttons. Similar to the wireless sensor, pour several portions of fuel, for example 20 liters, into the tank. During the procedure, click the Add Portion button after each portion is added and the level is stable. After that, hit the Finish button and save the table. Mounting seals. Guide the wire through the holes of the sensor's protective cap and fix it with a seal. After that, the installation is over. Reliable fuel level sensors by Escort Monitoring Systems.